So the upwelling is not an instant process. So it's not like you press the switch and the water turns up at the surface. So instead of that, it takes a while for the water or subsurface water to be upwelled to the sea surface. Okay? And this is what we call partial upwelling and full upwelling. Full upwelling is the, the, mech, the process um, of, of just what it says, full upwelling to the sea surface. It's shown here on this little sketch up. And partial upwelling is a mechanism where you still don't have the nutrient-rich water in the euphotic zone. Okay. And this is linked to so-called subsurface plankton blooms that I described in the previous lecture. So have another look of, of at the previous lectures where, where subsurface uh, plankton blooms are described. Okay. The important feature here is that you can only identify full upwelling in satellite images of sea surface temperature and, and uh, ocean color. Only the full upwelling is, is what you can identify. But that's also the, the one that has the strongest um, plankton uh, signal, okay? Because light intensity is the largest near the, near the surface. So you have maximum um, photosynthesis for full upwelling. Okay. <clears throat>